the genetic potential. What could you have been genetically? What was your potential for skeletal muscle? How was your potential to get jacked, so to speak, without steroids? If you, like me, really never got to find out because I was on steroids at the ripe old age of 13, then this is nothing more than, let's just say, entertainment. But I found a calculator that I'm going to put the uh, link below from a scientist named Casey Butt. I, I didn't make up the name. I'm just telling you he was a natural bodybuilder and a scientist. But he came up with a calculator and a formula that would tell you what your natural potential would be as a natural bodybuilder. It will tell you how much weight you could have gained, how big you could be without steroids. I think it's interesting because when you really start to study natural bodybuilders, you find out that they can put on about a pound of muscle a month for about the first year to two years, and then everything exponentially starts to slow down. So the natural bodybuilder, if all things are perfect, if they are eating, recovering, not getting sick, and they're training well, they're sleeping well, all things are in a perfect state, then you can look at gaining 40 to 45 pounds in your lifetime of muscle. That's according to the data in the research. A woman naturally can look forward to about 20 to 25 pounds of muscle naturally in her lifetime. Now, again, that's all things considered. You say, what about a guy that's on steroids? Well, you can know that like for me, when I got to over 300 pounds at 5'8", that's nowhere near natural. And we know that, right? But according to research, a guy that's on steroids can gain anywhere from four to five times the number of a natural guy. That's, that's crazy. That's crazy numbers according to research, okay? Now, I'm not here to fight over the numbers. I'm just telling you the data that I've read and the studies that I've read, that's what I'm seeing. So I think it's pretty crazy. But it's very cool to go and to look at the numbers in the calculator in the link I'm putting below, and I really want you to go look at it because you are going to really be entertained. Now, if you're a natural guy, this is going to answer some questions for you. It'll tell you how close you are to reaching your genetic potential. Now, according to this study and this calculator, you will reach your genetic potential in your uh, if you're in your prime, you will reach that genetic potential, all things being perfect, of course, uh, the things that we talked about, all of that stuff, if it's perfect, you will reach your genetic potential in four to five years. Now, what happens after that? Well, after that, everything slows down and it becomes just what they said, just micro gains over time. And so... So when you're a natural bodybuilder, you have to be much more dedicated to the craft because it is going to be a lifetime for you. It's something you can do for a lifetime. You will see a lot of pro bodybuilders, guys that are on steroids, that once they get off and they start to get older, they become wrecked. I mean, you look at their physiques, they look unbelievably terrible. Now, one of the guys that I really like to watch is a guy named, everybody knows him, Dennis Wolf. Look at him now, or at least the last time I saw pictures of him, he was about 200 pounds and he was really into uh, working out, CrossFit. He was really in, uh, into running, things like that, that as far as I could see. But he was really into the cardio side and his health. And so that's what you have to do if you are one of those guys that was enhanced. Again, I did the same thing. 
what am I doing? Well, I retired in 2019, and I have been trying to lose the weight ever since. And I have stopped all of the steroids only on HRT from my doctor, and I am slowly losing weight, but I have really focused on going to the doctors, getting my health checked, making sure my nutrition is more on point so that I don't become this physical wreck like most of these guys do. Now, here's what I want you to do. I want you, if you will, go to the calculator, and I want you to, to, to do it. I want you to take a look at it, whether you're enhanced or you're natural, and see what your natural genetic potential is or was before you started taking steroids. If you're natural, like I said, go there, check it out, and then I want you to put it in the comments below because I'm really interested to see if this thing really holds true and what do you think about it. I think it's fascinating. Again, thanks for coming in. We're talking about genetic potential. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and hit that notification bell, if you will, because I want you to see every video. We're coming out with a lot of great stuff coming up, and I love having you here.